What's the difference between objectification and preferences when you're sleeping with someone of a particular type? Someone bigger, of color, or tall, short, older, younger, whatever it is. I am here with Reed Malco from ReadAboutSex.com. And I am here with Kathy Vertuli, last time I checked, of the IntimacyDojo.com. You sure? I don't know. Are you Kathy or are you an imposter? I, I can't tell you. There you go. So we were just doing another video. Someone asked about um, finding a larger size, a full-size man to play with. Mm -hmm. um, and we were talking about how um, we were sharing about it, it can feel not good to some people or really good to some people to be objectified for a certain feature. And I've had people come up to me and like, oh, you're you're a big person. You're like, I want to fuck you. Or I want to like... like they were very I get up all in your stuff yeah because of this like, thing we haven't have. even said hello I like beards oh yeah. get up all in your beard um and it's not my preference to be objectified like I did not find it a turn on I felt it very mm -hmm. I felt very like no go away um and some people love being objectified mm -hmm. um but we wanted to discuss <laughs> the beard the beard <laughs> <laughs> but that is a thing like some people are like no please like stare at my boobs and yeah. other people are like my eyes are up here I have a couple of friends that one one who I can think of in particular who wears a little uh, uh, hypnotic rings around her like and she's very well endowed and I, I had to say can I objectify you because my eyes are going there and she's like yes please she's just baiting you yeah she was but I was no like tits. I'm like I understand why some guys have trouble like I can't not look Anyway, and she was, she's like, yes, please. I'm like, okay, thank you. Um, <laughs> but um, I think it's important to discuss that. We were allowed to have preferences. Mm -hmm. um, well, a good, a good friend of mine will actually go up to people and be like, in, in appropriate situations, this is not necessarily to grocery store, right? But at a sex ed conference <laughs> or a play a party. Meeting? Not at the PTA. Um, but at, a, at an origin, we'll be like, may I objectify you? Like, would you... Would you, are you into objectification and may I objectify you in these ways? Like, she's very um, precise about how that she asks yeah. permission and then can turn it on or off. Like, yeah. if somebody says no, she's like, thank you. Like, she yeah, has but, facility around that. Yeah, that would feel comfortable. I like the one time I can think of was I was at Body Storytelling mm -hmm. and um, I wasn't telling that night, I was just hanging out. And this bodystorytelling.com, great place to go. Um, but this gentleman, younger gentleman came up to me. He's like, oh my God, you have amazing curves. And I'm like, thank you. And he's like, your skin is great. You should... You. Uh, he didn't sneeze. This is just me now. He's like, you should like show off your skin more. And he was going into like detail. Like, I should wear low cut dresses. And he's like, I want to buy you chocolate cake and feed you. And I was like... Wow. I was like, ew. Like, not consensual at all. And he kept... And I was like... Okay, so here's the question. Yeah. How could they have a, have said the said the same content differently, and did it occur to you not as gross? Um, I think if they had said something like, I mean, even if they said, "I really enjoy bigger women. I love mm -hmm. your curves. Um, can I get to know you?" Like, I for me, there was no. There's no relatedness. There's there was no, no relatedness, but also when I said no, I'm not interested. It, he kept describing how I like. He kept going pat. Like mm -hmm. I'm like, no, that's not my thing. I don't no. enjoy that. And how this is? I'm just curious now. Like, let's find out together, shall we? Um, how could he have revealed the cake thing? Which again, like, if you're a nerd about kink and fetishes, like, there's a whole world. I didn't know. I went home and looked it up. There's okay. something called feeding where. Um, someone will feed a larger person and they try to keep them fat. How come there's no... Is there one for feeding skinny people? I'm sorry if that was insensitive, but like I just never thought of it. I'm like, yeah, what's that one? Yeah. Right? Um, but that's kind of... I think that's all like... Now I'm going to make a joke. But that that's kind of like a mom thing. It was uh, like, you know... Well, there's people like, that do You little, look skinny. Yeah. Come, feed you. But, yeah. all right. So... Anyway, that's not my fetish. It was not anything okay. that I was interested in. So, the, so there is Like, that, I appreciate my curves, but I'm not trying to get someone to try to make me or help me be bigger. Or, is there a way that they could have revealed that, though, that quickly and had it land on you as respectful? Uh, um, I don't think... Because there was no relatedness, I didn't have any, like, 
I didn't even know who this person was. Mm-hmm. I didn't have any sense that they knew who I was. Sure. Um, that I think that would be hard. But I, I don't have a problem with people like, if you just said, hey, I really appreciate your curves. Are you interested in feeding? Or have you heard of feeding or anything like that? Like, I would have been okay with that question. But mm-hmm. the fact that he started, like, describing pers- in he was detail. personalizing it for me without my permission. Sure. Which, again, like, and you can confirm this or, or not uh, if I'm accurate. They were starting to get turned on yeah. without your consenting to them being ter- like, there's a, hey, there's this thing I'm excited about. And then there's like, hey, there's this yeah. thing I'm excited about. Like, yeah. those are two very different energies. Yeah. And the second one needs to be prefaced with, hey, there's this thing I get really excited about. And I mean, you know, and I will get like pervy excited. Yeah. If you're okay with it. If you're okay with it, yeah. but I can control it. Right. Yeah, it's like, I, I'm pirates are not my thing, but if I, I was into pirates and I was like, hey, are you into pirates? We talk about pirates a lot here. Because it's That's great. Pirate. Enough. Pirates are safe. Yeah. So like, I mean, if, actual like, arr, pirates. Yeah, so if I had a thing for like, blonde pirates, and I'm like, hey, are you into pirates? With beards. With beards. Like, I could ask that, being kind of curious, but not like, hey, I'm going to dress you. Like, without asking, hey, can, I'm going to dress hey, you up. And, do you like I can just see him in one of those white shirts. I have shirts. a parrot at home. It'll sit right here. <laughs> it's a little creepy when you're describing the person yeah. to them without their agreement. It can Got be it. a real turn on if they are a yes. Sure. Okay. So, what do you think? There's lots of deep stuff we just covered in that. Yeah. Anything so, else we want to end on? I just want to wrap up with object. In case you didn't watch the other video, objectification to me is when you identify some attribute about someone mm-hmm. and you decide you're turned on by them without any connection to who they are as a person. Preferences, I like that general trait. I might be looking for mm-hmm. it, but I also want to know who's inside. You're a human being to me, not just a, a curvy person. Okay. Curves. Yeah. And I'm feeling weird about the making the comment about feeding skinny people. How about we just, feed, is there a kink or fetish where people just feed people who are hungry? How about I think that? It's called a restaurant. Hmm. We'd love to know. If there is actually words yeah. for this, please let us know. And let me know. If I screwed up in this video, just let me know. Like, you can share it in a comment or email me. I'm not I'm all in my head about this. Oh. I don't know why. Just am. Okay. I didn't bring anything up for me, but we'd love okay. to hear. Cool. Thanks, everyone.